Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Uh, the Leo is still down, but I've been getting a lot of questions uh, for links and stuff, and a lot of questions about the controller and everything else on how to set it up and everything. So that's pretty much what today's video is going to be. Uh, all the links to all the parts where I got my bike, where I, how I'm fixing the battery, all the links to everything, even the brakes. I mean, this took a long time to put together for you guys, uh, but I enjoyed it, so I hope you enjoy it too. And uh, there's some special custom settings at the end uh, from one of my fellow YouTube friends. So stay tuned. <laughs> This right here is the 72 volt 40 amp hour lithium Taolio, the 724, which is what I bought at ridethewindebikes.ca, as you can see. Her name is Jolene. She owns the place and she's the best sales lady I've ever dealt with, and they are the best e bike shop, in my personal opinion. As I said, I'd be including all the links, as you can see, right up at the top. We've got uh, electric motorcycle, we've got, uh, that's Jolene, I just showed you the website there. And then the brake pads I did in the uh, brake pad change video. All the links to the battery parts I'm using to fix my battery, including the spot welder. Uh, the charge system, the uh, to make it level 2, J1772. Also the charger I used and the breakers I have it all running through. Uh, the test equipment I used to check out uh if my motor was okay um the links to all the controller stuff here's the link to the controller itself uh here's a diagram i found all the media fire links by the way have been uploaded by me because i was not able to find uh the software or the diagrams or any of that stuff that i used to be able to find so i just put together a package for you guys and i've uploaded it to media fire and like i said all the links are down below but uh Okay, so there's uh, it's just a picture of the uh, function connector, the big connector, and what it wires out to, what it pins out to, um, as well as the programming cable that you need to program it all up, and the Windows files, the software that you need, uh, the driver's manuals, PDF files, uh, etc., is all in there. Uh, make sure you got WinRAR or 7-Zip or something like that. It is RAR files. Uh, and then all the settings. Uh, these were supplied to me. I would like to thank Tony Espinola. Uh, he's also a YouTube member um, who is subscribed to my channel and emailed me the custom settings for the Tau Leo specifically on the EM100 once you got the software up and running and everything. So I've also included the links to that. Uh, sorry, Tony, I cleaned up your files a little bit so the pictures are a little nicer and you can see the settings a little more clearer. Uh, but yeah, shout out to Tony's channel. Also, there's a link down below so you can uh, see the channel of the guy who sent me the links to the settings. All right, guys, I hope you all appreciated that video. And with those links and things, hopefully we can all get our EM100s working on our Tau Leos. And especially thanks to Tony Espinola once again for supplying us with the custom settings. So... That video took a lot to put together. That was a lot of links, a lot, and, a lot of looking back into old videos and stuff and figuring out what I linked everything to, including the brake pads and things like that. But it's done, and uh, so there you go. So there's more videos upcoming, still working on the puzzle and a few other things, so those will be in the future. But in the meantime, feel free to watch this video right here, and don't forget to subscribe. We'll catch you on the next one.